Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to a brand new episode of Stardew Valley for Breakfast, my modded Stardew Valley series. Oh, looks like we have some mail today, so let's go ahead and check this out. Robin here. I know there's a lot of stuff, a lot of stones scattered around your farm. I, if you have a surplus, you might consider having me build a well for you. Wells can be placed all over your farm and serve as convenient places to refill your watering can. Just swing by my shop with 75 stone and 1000 G when you're ready for it. Robin! Alright, so we don't have enough gold for now, so we'll have to wait and see um, for the future if we want to go ahead and build ourselves a well. Let's go ahead and water our little uh, plant that we have there. And oh, looks like our potatoes might be ready today, so that's pretty exciting. And let's go ahead and water our parsnips. And maybe we'll go ahead and give Lewis a potato for his birthday, since it's his birthday today. And when the villagers have their birthday, you have to make sure, well, you don't have to. Uh, but they definitely appreciate it if you remember their birthday and give them a gift on their birthday day. Makes them super duper happy, so we're going to have to make sure that we do that. There we go. And don't forget to water the beans and go ahead and pick up the potatoes. Awesome. And we do need a potato for this spring crops bundle. So let's go ahead and put a potato in this chest just so we have it. And there we go. And then we can go ahead and give this potato to Lewis for his birthday. Awesome. Yay. Alright, so let's go ahead and go into town today. Uh, so we can go ahead and visit with Lewis. And let's see, what else do we have to do? We have smelting. Use your furnace to smelt a copper bar. We don't have enough copper yet, so we'll maybe go in the mines today. Archaeology. Oh, yes! Gunther asked you to consider donating new artifacts, and we were able to do so. So let's go ahead and grab our money from that. 847G and delivery. Uh, we don't have any seaweed. Maybe we'll go ahead and try to get some seaweed today. And we also need to make sure that we go ahead and visit with the wizard and deeper in the mines and advancement. Reach level uh, one and craft a scarecrow. So we'll have to go ahead and craft a scarecrow too very, very soon. And they're supposed to be super duper cute because they are adorable little cats from the mod that I download. So all the scarecrows look like really awesome looking cats. So love cats and cats are fun, yay. <laughs> Lewis, I have a potato. Happy birthday. I got your birthday potato. Would you like to see a birthday potato? I got it for you. Let's see, is he down by his house right now? Uh, let's see, I heard a door. Is he inside here? Can I go ahead? It's locked open from 8.30 to 10 p.m. All right, so it's almost 8.30. So let's go ahead and just, you know, pick some garbage. <gasps> we got a broken CD, awesome. And it's 8.30, let's go ahead and open this up. And Lewis, happy birthday. I heard it was your birthday. I've been mayor of Pelican Town for over 20 years. Let's go ahead and give you your birthday potato. You remembering my birthday, thank you, this is great, awesome. No one ever runs against me when it's time for an election. I think, I like to think it means I'm doing a good job. Awesome. Happy birthday. And I wonder if that gave us a heart. It did, it gave us two hearts with Lewis, awesome. So he really did enjoy his birthday potato. So remember, guys, if you have any of your friends having a birthday, make sure you go ahead and give them a birthday potato because everybody likes a potato for the birthday. <laughs> and I really want to see if I can go ahead and deliver a uh, penny some seaweed. So let's do some fishing really, really quickly. We're not going to spend super duper too much time doing so, but maybe if we're lucky, we'll get some seaweed. I guess I should probably... Oh, look, there's little bubbly things. Ooh, let's go ahead and see if we can go ahead and get this little... Oh, all right. Can we even reach it? I don't even know. It might be too far. Oh, facing the wrong way. Oops, all right. Well, let's go ahead and see if we can get the fish that's over here. And let us see, let us see. And there we go. And we got some seaweed. Awesome, that is all we needed. All uh, right, yep, seaweed to penny. And I'm gonna see if we can go ahead and get like right there. I don't know if we can even go far enough, can we? No, I don't even think we can. All right, so Penny, I have your seaweed for you. I am ready to go ahead and deliver you some seaweed. So for whatever reason, you really fancy yourself some seaweed and I have some, so, you know, I'm ready. I'm ready to gift. I'm the gift giving person today, giving out potatoes and seaweed to anybody who needs. If you need a potato or seaweed and you're in need, don't you worry. Oh, we got some bread, awesome. Got some bread. I love when I get some stuff from the garbage. You get some pretty good stuff from the garbage. Hey. 
What do you want to... What? You want to talk to me? I'm busy. I guess he must be busy. Uh, trying to, uh, get better at sports or something. Alright, alright. We'll let him do his thing. Let's go ahead and see if we can find Penny. She might be in the library. Tutoring some of the children. Uh, not yet. She's not in there right now. Let's go ahead and check the garbage really quickly. Nothing in there. And we might as well go ahead and check the garbage that is up here. Too. And it looks like there is some green algae. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Actually, uh, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. You know, I found better things from the garbage, you know? Not, not gonna lie. Definitely found some better things. Alright, so let's go ahead and say hello to you. Uh, Penny! Hmm, hello. The weather's interesting today, don't you think? And she was on the lawn of seaweed, correct? Yes, Penny! I am here to deliver you the seaweed. Hey, you brought me an item I asked for. It. Thank you so much. Here's a little something for your trouble. Awesome, what do we get? What do we get? We get money. We get some money. 60G, awesome, we did it. We almost have a thousand gold. I'm so excited. Sorry, she's doing something. She must be busy. She must be busy, girl. All right, so let us see what we can do today. Uh, I really want to get some more copper. Let's go ahead and say hello to Harvey. Hmm. I'm struggling to make ends meet. I don't have enough patience. I guess I should try to get some patience from the neighboring towns. Oh no, it's gonna be okay, Harvey. It's gonna be okay. And then Mario, she isn't in there right now. Anybody in the store? Oh, just Louis. Or Pierre, I should say. Pierre. Let's go ahead and talk to him. Sigh. I got those behind the counter blues. Oh, it's gonna be okay, man. Let's go ahead and see what he has to sell today and see. Wallpaper. Ooh, that looks pretty cool. And there's some fancy red wallpaper there. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Now let's go ahead and go down this way. And I guess what we can do is try to go ahead and gather up some more copper because we do need um, a little bit more to go ahead and make ourselves a copper bar. And then maybe tomorrow we'll go ahead and visit with the wizard a little bit and see what's going on uh, with him and all that jazz. Because he really wants to see us because we were able to uh, find ourselves, you know, a very mysterious looking book in the community center. I hope Demetrius doesn't blow the house up with all those science experiments. <laughs> She's so funny. Uh, and then let's see what she has to sell today. Shopping. Uh, she has a little houseplant, which looks absolutely adorable. She has a yellow couch, an orange office stool, winter dining table. That looks pretty cool. Alright, and budget TV and a floor TV. And let's go ahead and say hello to Maru. Hi! Do you have fun working at the farm? Yes! Yes, I do. Well, that's good, isn't it? Yes, it is. And Demetrius, what's up with you, buddy? It's good to take a break from work every now and then. Yes, I guess I'll kind of difficult when you live on the farm though hey at least in the winter you don't have to worry about the crops that's right when winter comes you don't really have to worry about the crops too much because we can't really grow that much during the winter time uh, that's okay though and let's go ahead and go up here we can go ahead and talk to linus i wonder would linus like algae uh why would you give this to me do you think i like junk just because i live in a tent that's terrible <gasps> Linus. Someone was throwing rocks at my tent last night. I just had to wait it out. I'm sorry, Linus. I didn't know you didn't like algae. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <sighs> Alright, so let's go ahead and put our daffodil in there. Uh, we'll bring the bread just in case we get a little bit hungry. We'll put this stuff in there. We'll put the axe in there. We'll put the scythe in there. And there we go. We just have our sword and our pick and our bread. And we should be pretty good to go. Let's go ahead and go down to the elevator and go to level 5. And looks like there is a little slimy dude right there. So let's go ahead and get him. There we go. Get the slimy dude. Slimy dude, why are you so slimy? He's pretty mad. There we go. We got you down. And if we get to level 10, we will unlock the elevator for level 10, which is going to be pretty cool. And there we go, we got some bug meat, which we can actually use to make some fish bait in the future. So that'll be pretty nice to do. There we go, awesome. And we need to find a way down to level 6. So in order to do so, I think we're going to have to go ahead and break some of these rocks to see if we can find 
our way down. There we go. Anything? Oh, there we go. We made it. Ooh, there's some torches down here. Nice. And there's a chest with a cave carrot. Let's go ahead and grab that and break some of these stones. And let's go ahead and break this stone. This stone. We're really looking for some copper. I think I just need about two more pieces so we can smelt a copper bar. There we go. Let's go ahead and get you. And, ooh, there's some pretty cool music going on right now. Right, let's get the slimes. Oh, slimies. Why are you so slimy? You made me slimy. And let's go ahead and get this. There we go. Awesome. And, uh, uh, excuse me. Let's go ahead and break this open. Got some stone in there. Ooh, and there's another little barrel, too. And it looks like there is an earth crystal. Yay! You can go ahead and gather up that, too. And go ahead and get some of this right there. Some more copper. Awesome. And looks like the way down is right there. So now we are on level 7. I think that's how far we got down last time. And ooh, look at all that quartz. Oh no, that copper too. There's a little bug right there, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and get that guy. And go ahead and get this quartz. And let's go ahead and get all this copper. All oh, this copper has belonged to me now. I need it. I need this copper. This copper belongs to me. I need all this copper. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. Excuse me, little shell guy. Sheldon, leave me alone. Okay, Sheldon. Just just leave me alone, bro. Just leave me alone. And let's go ahead and open this up. There we go. And let's go ahead and get this. Awesome. And oh my gosh, there's so much copper down here. I think this is the area with the most amount of copper. Uh, at least so far that we found, which is pretty cool. And let's go down, down here. And down to this away and down here. And anything over here? Let's go ahead and see. Anything there? Ooh, our energy is getting pretty low. Uh, we can go ahead and eat this bread. Let's go ahead and do that. Awesome. And we got plus 16 health and plus 49 energy, which is pretty cool. So we have a little bit more energy to go ahead and do some more things. And it's already 6 p.m. Oh my goodness, time flies when you're having fun down in the mines. And we still don't know the way to go down, so we're going to have to go ahead and see can find that we're gonna have to break a bunch of these rocks and see oh gosh Sheldon leave me alone Sheldon leave me alone all right and we'll get this down this and I'm starting to feel exhausted all right I don't think we're gonna make it I think we're gonna have to go ahead and uh go back up the elevator if I can find it oh gosh guys we're lost we're lost. We're gonna be stuck down here forever. Oh wait, we can go down here and leave the mine. All right, and let's see. Do you want to take our scythe with us? We can leave some copper down here. And let's see. You know what we could do? We could go ahead and make a fur. Oh, we need twenty copper to make a furnace. I was gonna say we can make a furnace uh, and use that. Let's go ahead and leave this here. I guess we can leave some stone here. Some bug meat we can leave here for now, too. Uh, let's go ahead and take the mussel, the daffodil. We'll need our tools. Let's leave some wood here. Let's go ahead and grab this. Oh, we definitely need our watering can, too. Uh, let's go ahead and leave that cave carrot down here, too. So it's our inventory. We got some inventory issues right now. You know, we have a little bit of inventory problem, but that's okay. You know, we'll, we'll get a backpack soon, and then we'll have more room for activities. Don't you worry. Uh, but let's go ahead and make our way downtown walking fast faces past and i'm homebound uh and head on to home and we should have enough copper now to actually go ahead and make ourselves our very first copper bar so that's gonna be pretty exciting the first copper bar that we ever coffee copper bar did <laughs> and there we go oh looks like there is the foliage over there too that we can go ahead and harvest up but our inventory is full so let us go ahead and let's see. We're gonna have to use this earth crystal for the community bundle. We can go ahead and put um, one of those. Let's go ahead and put one of those in there. But then we can sell these two for now, or we can keep them for later. 
Uh, I might sell them for now just so get, we can go ahead and make some more money. This daffodil. Let's see, this mussel. I think we got two of those. Let's go ahead and sell this one. And we'll sell the daffodil for now. Alright, we should be pretty good. Uh, let's go ahead and see if we can smelt ourselves um, some copper. I think we'll need some coal. Hopefully they have some coal in here. Do I have some coal up here? Please have some coal. I need coal. There we go. We got some coal. And we can go ahead and put some copper in to this furnace. There we go. And make ourselves a copper bar very, very soon. And we can go ahead and put this copper in here for later. And we have a random gravel path. Can we sell that? Can we make money off gravel paths? I don't know. Uh, yeah, we can. Awesome. Let's go ahead and sell all this stuff. There we go. And we can go ahead and get some more water in our watering can to fill that up. And let's see. Tomorrow, we can go ahead and get ready for everything else. There we go. And I wonder how much money that we're going to make today. So let's go ahead. Oh, our copper bar is done. <gasps> we're going to complete a quest. Oh gosh. Didn't mean to break that. Almost ruined our energy. Uh, copper bar. Journal updated. Let's go ahead and check up our journal. And advancements. Craft. Let's see, did we get anything? Kill signs. Under the tower. Deep in the mines. Uh, I guess we didn't really get anything, did we? That's too bad. I wanted things and stuff, but that's okay. We'll put the copper bar right there for now. And I guess we'll go ahead and call it early today since we are totally out of energy. So let's go ahead and go to bed and see how much money that we've made for today. Day 7 of spring, year 1. And we made a total of 111 buckaroos. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Stardew Valley for breakfast. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for another episode. Bye!